Hey guys, my name is Tanzil and welcome back to my channel. Now in this video, we are going to see how to create a snapshot of our guest operating system. In the last video, I have shown how to install the Mac OS Monterey on VMware Workstation Player. So to create the snapshot, there are a few steps which I'll just show how to do them. Now the first step is to make sure that your VMware Workstation 16 Player is turned off. That means you have exited the application or you have closed the application. After that, just open your task manager. If you don't know how to open it, just right click on your start button, and then click on task manager. Then under the processes tab, you have to look for the processes which are running by the name of VMware. And you try to close as many of them as possible. Some of the processes might restart again, so you don't have to worry about that. Just try to close the processes which can be closed and then close the task manager. All right, now that we have closed the VMware workstation, open the folder in which you have installed or saved your virtual machine. Like for my case, it's saved in the documents. Under the documents, I have a folder named virtual machines. Under the virtual machines, I have the folder for my virtual machine that is Mac OS 12. Now all you have to do is copy this folder and paste it at the same place or if you want to create the snapshot at a different location then you can copy the folder from here and paste it at a location of your choice. But for me I'll just copy and paste it here because I'm going to keep the snapshot in the same place. Now once the copying is over you can just rename the folder like you can give it a name let's say vm snapshot all right finally we can close this file explorer then open up your vmware workstation player all right then click on player then scroll to file and then scrolling on the right side click on open and then you have to browse to the folder where you have saved a copy of your virtual machine. So just browse to that folder, open it and then click or select your VMware virtual machine configuration file. All right. Now you can see that your snapshot has been added to your existing virtual machines. Now to make sure that the first one is the snapshot and it's not your original guest operating system. I can just click on edit virtual machine settings and if you click on hard disk you can actually see that this disk is saved under the folder vm snapshot so that means it's a snapshot so i'll just rename it just below virtual machine name where mac os 12 is written you can just add snapshot All right. And then finally play your virtual machine now it's going to ask whether this virtual machine have been moved or copied since we have copied it so i'll just click on i copied it all right and then your mac os monterey is going to boot up and there will be no problem or issue or any kind of error your snapshot is going to boot up just like your original guest operating system and then after that you can just close this snapshot and start using your guest operating system in case if you face any problem or there's a system crash then you can always revert back to your snapshot and in the same way you can create more snapshots i hope it's clear how to make a snapshot and just having one snapshot is not enough you can create many snapshots after or before doing any kind of changes to your system so I hope by now you know how to create a snapshot on your VMware workstation player. So that's all for this video. I hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching.